What is the attraction to why high school students do this? Their friends do it. It's like small, convenient, easy to hide. El vaping es um, uh, es malo para las personas menores y si ellos fuman demasiado, les puede arruinar sus pulmones y agarrarles cáncer. Uh, I think because a lot of popular kids do it or um, team captains or like kids on sports teams. So I feel like a lot of people do it to fit in. It's easy to get. It makes your veins smaller, which allows the blood flow to be less to your brain and it makes you lightheaded. Do it for fun and then it turns out like then they're addicted and they can't live without it. Have you seen the news lately about vaping? Yeah, there's a ban. Yeah, I have. I've heard a lot of news. The news? Mm, um, yes. Jeez. It's disgusting. I don't like it. It makes me not want to do it, and I, I don't do it. I don't vape like that. If it doesn't happen to somebody in your community, I feel like a lot of people don't really care. I think there should be another way to stop, and I don't think there could be a ban, because like, people are addicted. I mean, obviously, if you've done a little bit of research, I'm not saying you should be actively doing research, but like, you should be a little bit scared. Um, I think most of the people around me, like in school, have an addiction to it. And I think it affects their wallet. Um, it makes them fiends and they keep asking like every day. El vapor es algo que les causa mucho daño a su salud. Eh, si ustedes lo hacen mucho, les puede dañar sus pulmones, eh, traerles otras enfermedades como el cáncer. Eh, Posiblemente si ustedes no dejan el vicio pueden llegarse a morir. Muchas personas como ven en las noticias están muriendo a causa del vapor. It makes them more prone to other drugs or saying yes to other things that they normally wouldn't. They have like a nasty cough and like they think without it they're not them. They stress about it more than they should because it's not really that. It's not really that important at all. It's not just a decision you're making right now if you pick up a jewel and start doing it. It's going to affect you later on in life um, in ways you may not think it will. And sooner or later, you're going to realize that you made a big mistake. Don't do it or you're going to get addicted and then it's not going to help you in the long run. So, un consejo que les podríamos dar es que podrían ustedes poner de su parte para poder dejar el vicio, porque si ustedes bien saben que si no lo dejan, podrían llegar a, a morir y es algo que nadie quiere. The dangers of vape products is it makes your pockets empty. And that it's not cool. It's not something that you should do to fit in. Just be yourself. There's no reason why you need a little smoking device thing to make you seem cool or fit in more. Y les, les digo que por favor dejen de fumar el vaping porque es malo para las personas menores. It's just like not even worth it. Save your money, kids. You're paying to die. Uh, vaping is, it, it tastes good, one, which is like partially why it's easy to get hooked on and it's definitely like a satisfaction when you hit it. Um, usually it takes about three hits to get like a, like a buzz, so-called. And it's like a tingly sensation kind of, you get a little bit dizzy. It's like, be, it's kind of like being lightheaded. You should be fine, but I mean, I get the withdrawals are pretty bad. Uh, headache, and like, maybe like, even like a feeling in your stomach too. And like, it's more like of an addiction to hitting something rather than actually being addicted to it. It becomes like a habit, like after you eat, 
like if you, you like while you had it after you, you usually hit it or something like that. Like it's those are the times when it gets worse because like you think about it. Like, oh, I wish I had it. And um, some kids, some stores will let you buy them if you walk in without even carding you. And then some people buy them and like resell them for profit. And uh, yeah, stores are really like lenient with the underage thing. I am devastated by the fact that people are up to the fact that they're addicted and it has to cause them to go to the hospital and get violently sick and die.